Hello, heathens. Welcome back to part two of Firewatch. All right, let's just get straight into it. I was kind of distracted in the last one. It wasn't really, uh, wasn't really, uh, I was, I was just taking my time a little too much, so. I'm awake. I'm awake. What's your problem? Our problem. Sorry, our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. I don't really know why that would be the case. Can I go fix it? Well, you probably can't, but what you can do is hike out to where the wire runs through your area and report back if it's down. Then I can track down a ranger to get someone on it. Okay, I can do that. Where is it? Remember that cave you hiked through yesterday? Yeah, of course. So, you're gonna wanna go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Oh god. Will do. Thanks, Hank. Go straight to the cave that I went through. Uh, why am I glitching all over the place? What the heck was that? Am I going crazy? I swear I saw that. Ah, uh, oh well, alright. Guess we can look at the map and see where we're going. Hmm. Yeah, it's by Cash 306. Or actually, is it the long way up? No way. It was. This is down here to the slide. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I just gotta go back that way. Oh god, it's gonna be a long journey. I already know it. Okay, well... In the last episode, if you guys missed it, we came across two skinny dippers that we had to, uh... We had to <laughs> put our foot down and tell them to stop messing with fireworks in the forest. Because that's not ever a good idea. Start a fire, you know? We should not let that happen in the forest. And... What else I did you fell prey to the Forest Service's big oh. recruiting effort? When it comes to, you know, how the hell you ended up out here? So always gotta talk when I'm talking. I saw the job in the paper and figured, you know, what the heck. What the heck? I've got no ties and no life. Better go spend what's left of it in utter loneliness. <laughs> uh, something like that. <laughs> yeah, thanks to last summer, the bump in Forest Service budget actually allowed for us to advertise for the job. Glad it worked. Why it worked. We also came by a very creepy guy. Um, hiking back up to our tower thingy, our watch tower. I don't know what you guys would call it, but... Um, just staring at us ominously and kind of creeped me out. We then discovered that our place was broken into. Not so great. Threw all of our stuff all over the place. Ron, really wish the powers that be could issue us radios that didn't suck ass. Most of the time, I'd prefer to keep things, uh, keep things pen to paper, but every once in a while, it'd be nice to get a hold of you right away. My sisters keep leaving me messages at the main office, but I don't think she gets that I took the job, so I wouldn't have to deal with her or mom. I've been sitting at the spot for a while now, thinking about what to say to her, but I'm a quarter way through this bottle of... Uh, what five fees instead? Miss you, Dave. Damn, everyone got problems out here. Nobody wants to face your problems head on. I don't think that's a good idea. Wait, where are we going? I always do this, I always just run around without looking at my compass. Is north of the canyon. Thunder Canyon? Where am I at? No way! I went the wrong way! Oh my god. Oh my god. Gotta go all the way back where I came from. Oh my lord. Oh, it's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder though, right? 
Yeah, they are. Uh. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what's life like? Uh. I just spend a lot of time with Julia. Oh, so you have someone there. Well. But you're taking a little break, or... We're... <sighs> Look, I'm sorry. Can you hold that thought? Uh, sure. Just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms up. Hey, oh. I don't think so. Why, have you? Oh. What? Okay, good. What? Uh, no, hey, your he button is idea. still down. I'm absolutely sure. <laughs> Would you? All right. I'll let you know if anything changes in that regard. No. Stop. What? Hey, sorry about that. Anyway, uh, Julia, girlfriend, ex. Sorry, I I don't mean to pry. Oh. As, yeah, the that? call, please. Who is who? I I don't think he has any idea. What what was that? Were you talking about me? Uh, what? You left your button pressed or something. Henry, that call was work. I was just talking to... Actually, it's not really your business. Why are you freaking out? I'm not freaking out. Good. I'm gonna go quiet for a little bit. Call me if it's important. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Sending me this way, though. Okay, so then I'll slowly start going up that way. Oh, would you look at that? Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. I don't like that she received the call and I got super defensive when I asked about it. If it really wasn't a big deal, I feel like it wouldn't be too much to be like, whoa, my mouse freaked out. It it wouldn't be too much to tell me what would it what it was about, I guess. Right? No? Just me? Uh Uh hey, I found a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, but you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. I mean, uh, I'm in the right area? I do believe. Uh, the comms wire runs for quite a ways. Follow it all the way to the top of Beartooth Point, and if it's not damaged, you can loop around back home. This looks a bit suspicious. I don't like- ooh. Oh, there's a butterfly. Oh my god, why am I jumpy? This is not supposed to be a scary game, but it does scare the shit out of me. What was that? What? Did I just break the game? I did just break the game. <gasps> if you guys saw that, that wasn't me. Um, it kind of just freaked out and threw me all the way back. What the heck was that? Huh. Found an old hat from a Korean war vet. You'd be surprised how many former service members take this gig. Well, makes sense. I imagine if you've been through war, you probably can't get enough silence. Anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello? Stop. Okay, then. Stop. No way. Oh my god. Holy crap. Look at that view, though. Uh, okay, it's too loud. That scares me. I'm out. I'm out. I'm getting freaked out. I think just being in the forest by myself is, is just making me a little bit jumpy. I... I feel like... I'm jumpy because I personally wouldn't have any way of defending myself if I were by myself out here. But that's just me. Uh. 
Oh my god, this goes on forever. This map is huge. What? Oh, okay, it's just ambiance. Atmospheric noises, got it. Yeah, I definitely wouldn't be able to do this job. Especially having to stay out here by myself. Um, no. After seeing that break-in, that would have been like... The last thing to just... That will be my tipping point. I would have been like, I want to go home. I will hike right now all the way back home. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Really? Awesome. Good find. It's like, I don't know, a mile and a half east of me. You just follow the trail up the hill, you can't miss it. I'll go see what the damage is. Before we do that... I gotta get this box. See if it glitches me out again. What was I... I was running, right, when I did that? Oh, I didn't do it. Okay. Another note. Hey yo, I got your note about needing to talk, and I'm uh, sorry I didn't track you down. Been looking for you all day. Figured you'd be out near the canyon helping those grad students, but I guess not. I don't even know how I could really help anyway. We're coworkers, you know? Amigos. Professionals. If you need someone to throw a case back with and go time traveling, Ron's your guy. But I'm not great with the life stuff. You get it? Later, Ron. Okay, that's fair. Not everybody's good at communicating like that, and... It's pretty good that he he says that, you know, clarifies like, hey man, that's not my forte. Therefore, I don't think I'm the right guy. There's nothing wrong with communicating something like that. You should never feel bad for telling somebody you're not equipped to have conversations like that. Saves you a headache. Saves the other person a heartache. Oh, beer can? <laughs> Let me clean that up. Hey, so there are beer cans all over the ground up here leading up the hill. That's annoying. Yeah, thing is, there were a bunch down at that campsite yesterday. Coincidence, maybe? I don't think so. Same brand, everything. These fucking kids. Why do you think they'd be up here? The hell if I know, but they better have stayed away from our communication stuff. Ooh, they're sabotaging us now. Kind of nervous. We got enemies in the forest? Oh my god, we do. Oh. <laughs> uh. Inspect. It's doing it again. It's doing it again. What the heck? I'm slowly breaking the game. <gasps> no fucking way. I wonder if I didn't make the choice to throw the stereo in the lake, if this would even be happening right now. Oh. Hey, so the wire is, is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. Oh God, are you what? kidding me? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Mm. Oh, sure. <laughs> oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out no, of them. No, come yeah, on. I think costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm, I don't know. Um, wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. No. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am going to need a raise. <sighs> don't right? Your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Oh, they're big into Red Eagle. Huh, great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. 
Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. The idea of, like, scaring a few teens because they cut the, the wire and then the fireworks and breaking into the lookout. It's not best to fight fire with fire. I think that might be an immature choice. And it might not help the situation any further. Knowing some teens can be very childish. They might just want to keep doing it more and more to get square, you know? Oh, if you look at that. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. <gasps> True, you're right. Wait a minute. Hello? Swipe? Swipe? Is it because I have this out? Oh. Nice. What's in it? Oh! Flashbang! Wait, I can take pictures now? Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them. In decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's, there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Only three to four? Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. We about to find a dead body right now? <sighs> Someone who's went missing, like, years ago? Was he a ranger or something? Oh, no, no. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, oh. three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? Mm, no. Stop you talking, know, I have something important to say. They took off halfway through the summer. You know what, so she's taking long. Oh, oh, finally. Uh, oh, okay. Nothing Why? about the- the All right. I never really hit it off with old Ned, and, um, one oh, day they were just gone. Sucks. Anyway, so it goes. Have, uh, fun with that camera. Try not Thank to you. anything that would scar a photodome employee. I don't know, I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Mm-hmm. Dave, guess who's going out with Debbie next week? No, not... That shit heel Steve. It's your man, Ron. I went up to check out the new guy at Two Forks and heard him talking to himself more than usual for LOs. So I figured I'd stay away. Remember when you saw Chimney Rock having himself in that hammock? Oh, what? Having himself in the hammock? I don't even want to know. I'm starting to think the Forest Service only picks the deranged and perverted. <laughs> Except for us, of course. We're the... Creme de la creme. Let's toast to Deb at the spot. Ron. <laughs> Having himself in the hammock is crazy. Oh my god. Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Oh really? Oh really? She sounds uninterested. I see a really thin plume of smoke. Yeah, I see it too. A thin plume like this is either a new fire, or a campfire. Campfire? You, you think it's them? I reckon so. It looks Probably. like it's to the southwest of me. That's right. If you hike towards Five Mile Creek, that should put you in the neighborhood. Keep an eye on that smoke plume. Let me know oh. if it's getting any larger. Will do. Let me try this disposable camera. It keeps nagging me to try it. Wait, what? Oh, stop with that. I'm having a hell of a time getting this <laughs> fucking flapjack off his ass and out to repair that wire. Excuse me, flapjack? You know, like a loser, a chotch. I really don't. What? But I do now. Well, the next time you're at a bar and some banker steps on your foot so he can order his crappy martini. You've got just the name to use. All right, bet. Thank you. I'm adding that to my arsenal. 
Hey, Flapjack, why don't you wait your turn before I bounce your face off a dumpster? It's beautiful! Uh... I mean... I can think of a million other things to say that are way cooler than that. I would probably laugh at somebody who called me a hey, flapjack. <laughs> sorry about snapping at you earlier. Um, I thought about it and... Yeah, I suppose that must have sounded kind of weird when you heard me take that other call. Plus, Thank you. you're just out here in your own head. Trust me, I know how it is. Mm-hmm. So... Did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? Oh, that's I what that is. I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but... <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. Wait, I don't mean that the way it sounds. I mean, I care about people, and... I like companionship as much as the next person. But why does it have to come from okay. the same person for your whole life? My Aunt Kathy was married to the same guy for four decades. And when he died, uh. she found out he'd been having an affair with a real estate broker. For 15 years. Oh my god! My Judy traveled the world dating artists and musicians as she saw fit. Call me crazy, but I'd rather spend a week in bed with Sonny Bono than half a lifetime with some cheating stockbroker. Uh, okay, well, well, okay, alright, well... That was it's a lot to uh I'm actually married. But you're here. Uh she's sick. And I shouldn't be here, but I am. Oversharing, I'm... but I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, am you are away? here and it's beautiful and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, sure. I think I went too far. Like I gotta go do a thing, but I'll have a radio. Okay, Crap. call me if you need to. What? Why is the music on? Scaring me and shit. There it is. I'm so jumpy. This game is supposed to be like beautiful and nice and yeah, here I am getting paranoid during the day and I just I don't know, I can't help it man. The forest just freaked me out. Something can come to you at all angles, you know what I mean? No, I keep pushing the wrong button. I'm freaking out right now. I don't know why. Hey, man. I didn't get music last time I was walking around aimlessly in the woods. Why now? Also, I'm really happy that Delilah decided to apologize for her, um, her little outburst that she had. You know, people get like that from time to time. It's okay. Um, but you still gotta take responsibility for your actions, and... It's not always fair to everyone if you decide to just act like that and not take accountability, you know? Even if your intentions were to hurt somebody, it can still hurt. What does she have? What? Oh. She's got Alzheimer's. Like, um, dementia. Whoa. How old was she? Is she? Is she? She's Thank alive. you. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you Delilah. guys found out? Uh. We were scared shitless. We went straight to the doctor after her first spell or whatever. They diagnosed her and we were both just very scared. Can't really tell when Julia is scared. <gasps> she just gets... Quiet. It's in person. She was very quiet. Mitch Michaels, 31, 62, 165, short, brown, distinctive facial hair. So last seen around Jonesy Lake on July 3rd, 1981. He was first reported missing on July 29th, 1981. By Forest Service personnel, he is not known to be familiar with the area. Last known location, Mitch was seeing. Run, okay, That's, yeah. Ford F-250. Okay. Oh, uh, I am breaking the game today. That's amazing. Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's, uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? Really? It's actually fascinating. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for oh. hundreds of years, <gasps> even through fire. Can oh. you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of Delilah, these things? be quiet. Things? Found one of their empties. Guess we're on the right track. Roger that. I'm on a manhunt right now. I'm trying to 
trying to find these two teens who keeps terrorizing me. I'm just trying to have a peaceful trip out in the woods. You guys are killing it for me. I can't see shit because of the sun. How am I supposed to see the plume of smoke? What is that? What is that? No, I don't want to report the waterfall. I want to report this. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Hmm. It's a really nice waterfall down here. Even those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. Yeah. I'm telling you guys right now, if I see something running through the woods, you know, like just... Ooh, I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm actually gonna jump. Again, it's not supposed to be a scary game, but... I don't know. Being out here by myself, freaking me hey, out. It's getting dark too. Um, Mexico? Is this some sort of riddle? I just have a nice view to the south. Trees and mountains forever. Well, eventually you wander into the area overseen by Chimney Rock Lookout, but that's probably an impossible hike in terms of terrain. Hmm. Okay, let's see if we could track back the, so, uh... How'd you meet? Delilah, every time I speak! Met in a bar. Birthplace of modern romance. I walked over and asked her what her major was because I thought she was a student, not a prof. Smooth. That's me. I did make the first move, though. Aw, oh, you were brave. I was <laughs> drunk. Oh my god, yeah, I remember that. He slurred the word, uh, major. Made her laugh. You can make a girl laugh and giggle, you can make the cheeks clap and jiggle. Am I right, boys? Hello? <gasps> oh, again? Leaving the frickin' fire? Ugh. I see a campsite and it looks like they've got a fire. Is it them? That seems like it. I swear, they must have dragged four cases of beer out here. Track them down, and don't let them see you. What a <coughs> this is. <coughs> ah, found my sheets! So they did break into your tower. Looks like. Okay, guys. If you're out here, don't you dare. The tent looks like it's been through the shredder. Which would Ooh. explain that scrap I found. What could have done that? Like a, like a bear, or um... I don't know, it sounds crazy, but even a bull elk if it's off its rocker. Dear Psycho, I hope you're fucking happy. We're leaving and we're going to find the police or whatever and tell them about how you creeped creeped on us in the lake and then came and destroyed our campsite and all of our stuff. Oh, and stealing panties is gross out. You're probably a mental fucking axe murderer and are so going to jail. I hope it was worth being a jerk over some fireworks. Dick. Whatever did it, did not hold back. You've got that camera, right? It might be a good idea to get a few snaps, just in case. Yeah, good thinking. Uh... Okay, but like... Keep. This is evidence. Everybody, off the crime scene, please. Wait. Let me go get a picture of my... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, of my sheets. Yes, perfect. Put the teens note. Zoom. Zoom, zoom. Zoom, 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 zoom. Okay, well. Yeah. That's all I had to do, right? Oh, they're gone, for sure. How can you tell? Well, the girls left someone. Me, I guess. A note. Well, what's it say? <laughs> Calling the police and think I attacked them? I need to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well... Uh, did you? 
No, well, hey, I didn't do this. Okay? Let me tell the Someone truth. or something went to town here, but it wasn't me. Because I told you to scare them, not assault them. I didn't. Of course I didn't. I just threw their stereo in the lake. Yeah, <laughs> I really wish you wouldn't have done that. This is, I don't know, weird as hell, but it wasn't me. It's, it's okay. I believe you. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers. They could be having a bad mushroom trip. <gasps> we really don't know, but What if it's gone. that one creepy There's guy no that we saw? The they're not coming back, and we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Yeah, me too. Wait a minute. Because I'm horribly superficial. Uh, like Burt Reynolds, Tom Cruise had a good-looking twin. Uh, we'll do that. One. I could be Tom Cruise's good-looking twin brother. Oh, that's too bad. I read in People he's like five foot nothing. Yeah, well, you can't win them all. <laughs> okay, well, that gives me a good start. Now let's see. In my scope, I can only tell you're a white guy wearing what, what? shorts. It's where. Hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. It's not very, uh, you know, PC or whatever they say. Oh my god, you are the whitest man. <laughs> I don't need a spotting scope for that. How would she rather see me? Then what do you normally like to oh. wear? Is that her over there? Uh. Tuxedos as often as possible. Oh, really? You bet. How cosmopolitan. I didn't realize Boulder was so chic. It's the peak of high society. <laughs> mm, good to know, Dale, yes. <laughs> now tell me about your face. I'm looking at you across the bar. What do I see? Oh. Uh, hmm. I have a thick beard. My nose has been broken. You'll enjoy my thin mustache and long hair. Well, thick beard. I have a pretty thick beard. Oh. Have you always had a beard? For a while, yeah. All right, perfect. I want to know if she's into eyes. him. Get out of here. I'm drawing you. I need to know. No You're way. What? Is is that okay? Uh. Don't don't answer. I'm gonna do it regardless. <laughs> Fine. All right. Your eyes. Tell me. Mmm. Steely. Happy. Tired. They look tired. I think. Oh yeah. Yeah. You know. You hit a certain age, and you just. You think you're a younger person who just looks tired all the time. <laughs> Speak for yourself, mister. I Dang. Guess that's old. Well, some people might see distinguished. Okay, got okay. it. Okay. Thank you, Henry. You get what you need? Absolutely. <laughs> She's drawing me. That's kind of cute. All right, what do we got to do today? Find boards downstairs to patch window. Downstairs? Got it, Chief. I'm glitching. I'm glitching. Glitching all over the place. Downstairs. Wooden board. That looks pretty good. Another good one. Get a couple more boards. Got you. Board up broken window. I can pick this up. Dang, with one hand, you're strong, buddy boy. Wow, we just grabs it like it's another piece of wood too. Board up. Playing cod zombies now. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm I got that window all patched up. So, what should I do now? What's next? What's next? What do you think is next? Well, you've been the one giving me tasks for two days straight. Mm-hmm. 
What's next is you sit in that room until September 1st and call me at the first sign of smoke. No way, it's that well, easy? Yeah. Why don't you let me know when you're mentally prepared for that task and uh, I'll give it to you. Uh, is that all it takes to be... To like, do this job? You just sit here all day and you just point and be like, Hey yo, a fire. What? Yo, give me my PC. Put it right here. Give me some food. And... Fuck it. I'll do this job as long as I have my PC and some good, like, internet. I don't even need, like... I'll get... Starlink satellite going, you know? From, like, SpaceX. I'll be Gucci. Got, like, one terabyte of fucking internet or however it goes. I don't know how much it is. It's really fast, though. I do know that. But, dang, I'd be set for life out here. Never mind all the stuff I said about being paranoid and whatnot. Got a few boards going here. Lock that. Yeah. I'll be living a lavish life. Look at this view, too. Come on, now. Get Delilah to get a PC set up going, too. We could play some... What? Delilah, what do you play? Valorant? Mm, no, she wouldn't play Valorant. She seems like the type to play Sims 3 all day or something. You know what I mean? She got all them mods going whimsical whims or whatever the fuck you guys call it and you weirdos <laughs> playing sims dirty ass avatars <laughs> or animations is what i meant anyway this is a good stopping point for part two of firewatch i hope to see you guys in the next video if you want to see any more content like this go ahead and subscribe comment what you guys want me to play and yeah i'll see you soon